Now, Boruto and Komaharu must try to escape the castle after they being framed for a crime they did not commit caused by the triplets who actually stole the Hashirama cells and actually fleeing the village, which every villager is trying to get their hands on the reward and try to capture them, which caused Sorda and Milky you know, to catch up with them. But they actually realize they need to try to come up with an escape plan to leave the land of silence. But there's only one problem. The perfume that they actually throw at Borto is still on him. So they knew they're going to smell the perfume. So Borto is trying to get rid of the perfume while they're trying to keep up with Komaharu and Sarda. But they actually knew how they're going to escape, which Komaharu will disguise himself back as Kirisaki, and he tried to get a black market manager to tell him about the intels about the triplets wearing the earrings, which they're actually outside the village, and they actually pay their respects to Yaruga, who actually sacrificed himself for the heights. Now they actually have the Hashirama cells, they're actually going to their master plan. But the manager of the black market has set Komaharu up because he actually let his bodyguards going to attack him. But Sarada has to rescue him by creating a hole on the roof so he can escape. Which is another lesson, don't actually go to black markets alone during a mission. During the fact that we see Boruto and Mukino try to get the scent away from Boruto, they actually saw a ditch with nasty smelling water, which Mukino thought it was actually a good idea, but it made it worse. So they find a well, and it actually did a trick. Well, only half right. But they actually realize they actually need, need a plan. So they actually come into a blimp where Sarada and Komaharu have actually come up, climb aboard. So they actually can escape the village. However, we saw the villagers using guns loaded with exploding kunai. And they actually shot the blimp down. But we actually knew how they're going to escape as they are surrounded by the villagers. They actually realized that the kid from earlier, whose name is Katara, actually came out of the manhole cover and actually let them escape. Which the others set out smoke bombs and they actually follow Katara. But they actually realized how he actually helping them out because he actually say thanks to his friend he owed him one by which their friend is Miski who actually is feeling better after being affected by Anato in which he also helped heal the girl whose name is Kona which they actually knew what they had to do but their only lead on finding the triplets is the poison kunai that was actually drawn by, actually drawn at Sakuya. But we actually knew how they're going to escape. Just then, Kanara actually decided to lead them out of the village. Meanwhile, in a restaurant, we saw Deepa actually enjoying a steak dinner. But we actually saw him attacking and killing people in the restaurant. And at least he actually is kind enough to pay for his meal. But we actually going to see what he's actually going to do. Meanwhile, we saw Katara lead them out of the village. Now they're going to track down the triplets. 
as soon as they actually going to find them, they were actually being encountered by three more ninjas. So we actually knew what this is all about because they don't actually have the Hashirama cells. So we're going to see what's going to, going to happen. So they actually got out of the village. Now they're trying to find the triplets who has the Hashirama cells. But they actually been encountered by three more ninjas. So we actually knew how they're going to escape that problem. Because we actually going to see... Because I actually recognize the shape of the three individuals. And I kind of understand who they actually are. Plus, we're going to see when Deepa is going to actually appear on the next episode next weekend. So anyway, like this video, subscribe for more, and comment a wee thing about the episode. You guys can also follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Tumblr, and my Facebook page. Until then, this is Anime Guy Journey here saying signing out. Laters, and be safe.